Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. This is Mova Reed, and today we're going to be talking about Swifty from Droplet. So this is going to be the new lit BUSD pool. And I actually have a special guest that doesn't even know they're a special guest, but Mushad Max is going to explain to us exactly what this Swifty pool is in more detail because I had trouble understanding what that is exactly. But today I think it's all going to be clarified for both of us. So if you guys have any questions, make sure to leave it in the comment section below. Oh, and also I did add to my position in Droplet. So I'm going to explain that to you guys in today's video. Okay, so let's get started. All right, guys, so I did add to my position and drop lit. And the reason for that is because I saw that the price of lit was about two dollars and 70 cents from a dip since bank teller jumped his tokens uh, recently. Uh, you guys probably heard about this elsewhere. I'm not going to touch on that because it's not really my place. I don't know all the information about that. All I know is he's he sold a bunch of his GDS tokens all at once or lit. I'm not sure exactly what he sold. But anyways, because of his dump, the price of lit went from like 6.8 or $7 down to $2.50. The golden drip share as well went all the way from 1500 to about 450 uh, And then it was climbing back up again. So I just thought it would be a cool position and uh, a cool time for me to get in with a bit more money. Just because we had just completed a uh, Friday lit talk. And in fact, I'm going to give you a bit more information on that later on. Uh, we had just finished a discussion with the developer of Droplet. Uh, and he had explained Swifty. Now Swifty is going to be kind of a, a, a means of locking in funds as a liquidity provider in order to ensure that funds remain in the protocol for a long period of time. Um, and we're going to get a clear explanation on how this works. But essentially, I thought that this would be a proper time for me to add to my position so that I could be eligible to be included in the pre-sale for Swifty when that launches. And I know that they started the testing back on Sunday. So that was three days ago and uh, the development is ongoing. I think they're working on that to make sure that they launch it very soon. So that's going to allow a lot of investors to put in their capital. It's going to be a pool just like the lit BUSD pool that's currently on Droplet. So it's going to be something like this. The Okay, so I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's this pool here, the lit BUSD pool. It's going to be a, a pool just like this one, except it's going to be a specific lit BUSD LP pool for Swifty only. OK, now what investors will be able to do is they can deposit their LPs in here. It's going to have that pool basically paying investors in BUSD just like the pick pen does. And it's backed by real world assets. So before we dive into Mushad's video, let me just tell you what exactly I added to my position. So I wanted to ensure to be eligible for the presale and to be able to be in the presale, you need a minimum of $500 worth of LPs as an lit BUSD. So I added to my position. The last time I made a video about this, I had about um, $280 or $290 worth of lit BUSD. So I added another $200 worth, approximately $220 worth, worth of LP in, in this uh, protocol. So I added another 71 LPs. And for me, it's a good investment because the price of lit was at a good price. And so far, I've, I've only went up in price. I think I went up by, by 20 cents. Uh, and I can estimate it going up even further in the next couple of days in anticipation of Swifty. Uh, so my value here might increase in value as well. This was 503 and now it's 508. I'm up by $5, baby. Anyways, I could be depositing more in here, but I don't have any BUSD to pair it with the lit. I have 17 lit in my wallet. That's from the boardroom. And now I don't know if you guys can see the total worth because my camera might be in the way but my total worth like if i compare it with what i sent moonshot i had in the boardroom 472 dollars and 503 dollars in the staking bit lit busd but since then since um since february 5th my position has increased to 597 in the boardroom and 519 staking 
And the reason for that is because there's $508 plus there's $10 that I earned that I can pick up in GDS. And in my boardroom, the value of GDS increased from when I got in. When I first got in, it was six. Uh, it was 580. I think it was 580 when I got in, and now it's valid at $707. So that increased in value, meaning my position as well increased in value. So, anyways, my total worth uh, on February 5th was 978, and right now it's sitting at 1,164. So right there, I'm already um, making back the money that I invested and adding to it. So that's very, very beautiful. All right, guys. So let's go over to Musha's video. He'll explain exactly what Swifty is, and then we'll be able to see if this would be a good investment for both of us. Let us stay. All right, so what is the Swifty contract all about? Well, it's all about real world asset backing. We're talking about real estate in Dubai. We're talking about getting BUSD with the revenues of the Droplet Protocol purchasing condominiums, mansions, apartments, right? They're gonna use these real estates to in order to generate revenue. And I believe 75% of that revenue that they're getting is gonna go to who? The people who's in the Swifty pools. So this is like enormous. The fact that we're gonna get passive income every single week in BUSD. And this has nothing to do with Droplet Protocol. This is a real world asset backing. If we take a look. Okay, so essentially, once you deposit your money in here, it's going to be locked, okay? You can't take it out. And if you wanna take it out, it's going to be locked for five days before you're able to take out your LPs. Now, one thing that needs to be understood is that if you ever get out of this pool, you can never go back in, okay? So let's say the first day there's a 1,000 people. The next day there's 500 left in the pool because everybody else decided to leave. Then what's going to happen is all the BUSD that's being generated from all these real-world assets is going to be distributed, 75% of it, is going to be distributed on five to 500 people as opposed to 1,000 people. So your share is only going to get bigger. Look at Dubai. You can see that huh, I want to go there right now. You know, it's freezing right now. It's the winter time in NYC. I wish... Hey, let me tell you guys. I've been to Dubai before because... Um, you know, I've traveled in the Middle East. I've traveled in the Middle East before. Dubai is one of the richest countries, but not only are they rich, but they're filthy rich, okay? And when I mean filthy rich, I mean filthy rich. In a good way. I mean, these guys have designed some of the most beautiful structures in the world, some of the most uh, complicated structures, some of the most beautiful structures, like the buildings, the condominiums, the suites, the penthouses, the 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 parks everything is so gorgeous it's so beautiful that you just want to live there so the fact that uh paris defi proof uh all the guys at, at uh, droplet are willing to invest in real world assets in dubai it's just so bullish because that market is only growing and growing and growing at an immense speed a couple of years ago like um, i don't know 20 30 years ago it was a complete desert but in the last few years, this thing has flourished. It's unbelievable. But anyways, these world assets are going to be paying investors on a weekly basis in BUSD. And the APRs on those pools are going to be paying investors in GDS as well. So you're going to get GDS and you're going to get uh, BUSD. So you don't even need to sell your GDS to pair it with LIT or anything else because you're getting BUSD. It's beautiful. 75% of those funds are paying investors BOSD. I was in Dubai right now in this in the globe Me pool too. Right I wish it's Dubai right now. Looking at the stars, looking really beautiful, nice weather, man. This is going to be awesome. All right, so I'm going to break down the entire Swifty Little Estate pre-sale just okay. so you know exactly what to expect. And at the same time, have the time to start saving up to see how you're going to get it. That's why I want to talk to you guys about this right now because... They started development in sun on Sunday, and this could literally be released at any point. So if you guys wanted to start saving, if this is something that you guys are interested in, then I want to give that information to you. 
anyways, I, I'm so passionate about Droplet right now because they're helping Drip in, in some way or another, you know? Just like the Guardians of the Reservoir, Droplet are burning Drip, uh, but essentially sending it to the tax vault, but it's helping the protocol. It's one of the sectors of this community that's actually doing something to help the protocol until we get some more utilities from Forex. And you just... Looking back at the video that I did last last Monday, guys, I don't want you guys to think that I give, I've given up on Drip. There's no way I'm going to give up on Drip. I love Drip. It's just I feel some kind of frustration that I think a lot of people are, and I felt the need to share it with you guys because at the end of the day, I want to be honest with you just like anybody else would be honest with you. I don't want to be sitting here lying to you. I feel the same pain you're feeling, but you know I have some kind of faith that Forex is going to fix it. We just have to wait, hydrate, and see. But anyways, let's get back into this. Your LP tokens, when the time comes, we could get lit together. Now, we're gonna have a Swifty pool, which is gonna be comprised of the lit BUSD LP tokens. Now, this lit BUSD LP pool, the Swifty pool, is going to have an APR, which Paris did not reveal yet. It might be a little bit higher, might be a little bit lower. Who knows? But we are going to earn golden drip share rewards in this pool this pool also is going to be giving us a pre-sale whitelist allocation so for example this lit busd lp pool is going to go only in increments of 500 that means you can deposit 500 dollars worth of lp tokens one thousand dollars worth of lp tokens two thousand dollars worth of lp tokens and that's going to be the exact amount that you are going to be allocated for the pre-sale whitelist for example if you have five hundred dollars of lit busd lp tokens inside of the swifty pool you are going to get a five hundred dollar allocation for the pre-sale very simple once swifty gets underway once they start buying these condominiums these mansions these apartments and they start getting that revenue you are going to get weekly busd rewards then another thing you gotta consider you could always leave this pool if you want but the minute you want to leave the pool there's going to be a five day lp lockup if you want to leave the pool so that means if you want to leave the pool on monday by the time it hits Saturday, then you're able to unlock your LP tokens and keep it moving. But one thing you gotta understand, once you leave the pool, you may not never, ever, 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 ever return back into the pool. So that's gonna be super bullish for the people that's already in the pool, because now, right, that 75% of generated BUSD is gonna go to them that's remaining inside of the pool. And this pool, I believe, is gonna have a cap on it. I'm not sure mm -hmm. if Paris decided on um, 300,000 or 500,000, but it's going to have a cap in this pool. So you already know once you get into this pool, it's going to be hashtag never leave Swifty because people are not going to want to get Swifty. out of these pools. So what is the benefits, right, of that Swifty pool? Number one. You're gonna generate golden drip share rewards just like the other, you know, pools that we are in. But we don't know if it's gonna be a higher APR or a lower APR. For me personally, and this is not what Paris said, but I'm guessing it's gonna be a little bit higher, you know, than the original pool. That's a good point. So essentially, there's going to be a daily APR that you're gonna be getting on these Swifty pools, just like you would on the regular lit BUSD. And what Mujad is saying here is it might be just a little bit higher to entice more investors to go in. Or it might not be. We're not sure 100%. But we're just guessing. It's going to be a little bit higher to entice investors to go and deposit their funds over there. But another bullish thing that he just mentioned is there might be a cap. Let's say 500k. If $500,000 worth, um, worth of dollars are invested in these pools then Paris is going to block it. Nobody can just come in and just add to that position anymore. And then he's going to start other pools and other pools and other pools. And then he's going to keep those funds in the ecosystem to add more and more liquidity, which is just beautiful. It's like going to be very, very deep liquidity. Pools, because this Swifty pool has a couple of big reasons why it needs to have a lot of money in there. Now, a so essentially, you know what happened recently with BT where he sold a bunch of his funds, like 50K or something, and just dropped the price of lit and GDS? 
a similar thing would happen but because there's a deeper liquidity then the price would not drastically fall like it did right now it's exactly a similar concept to the reservoir right now where the more bnb is in the reservoir the more and more bnb in the reservoir the less the cells affect the price of drip so that's why for example the guardians of the reservoir our main goal is to add to the reservoir as much as we can and not send it to the tax vault because we want to strengthen that floor price and we want to minimize the sell pressure on the price of drip by adding more and more BNB liquidity to the drip ecosystem, faucet, contract, whatnot. Another great benefit is the pre-sell whitelist allocation and we already know to make that BUSD. And we know that this is gonna provide a deeper liquidity. So guys, what did we learn so far? So if you want to get into the pre-sale for Swifty, you need to have a minimum of 500 lit BUSD LPs into the Swifty pools. And you have to match that with another $500 worth of BUSD so that that's going to be your allocation into the, um, the pre-sale, right? And then you're gonna be paid on a uh, weekly basis from BUSD in, in the form of BUSD from different real estate that they're investing in in Dubai. If you ever choose to leave from that pool, you can always withdraw your LPs. However, they're going to be locked for five days. And then following that, you're going to be able to withdraw them. Uh, the pool works in increments of $500. So you can deposit either $500 worth of LPs, $1,000, $1,500, $2,000, $2,500, $3,000, and so on. And you have to match it with an equivalent value of BUSD for the pre-sale. And... It's going to add added liquidity to the ecosystem so that the prices of lit and gds are going to be much stronger the best thing out of all this that i like is that we are going to be paid in busd and if you know something about me is i love bnb and i love busd which is why i'm so bullish on the dog pound linear pool i love the dog pound linear pool guys because it pays you in bnb i love the auto compounding pool because it pays in animal farm dog bnb i can just break that lp and take the bnb whenever i want to so for me busd and bnb are the most important assets right now in my mind with ethereum as well but in this ecosystem bnb and busd are the most important assets for me so that being able to be paid in busd in the pick pen and over here in the shrifty pool i'm gonna be so down so my plan is i'm going to try as much as i can to generate a thousand lps and right now we can see that i have around 510 dollars worth of lps so i need another 500 dollars in here and then i'm going to try to manage and get myself another 1000 dollars worth of busd so i can deposit i'm going to try as, as much as possible if not then at least i'll have a 500 in the swifty pool earning me busd and it's going to be a pool like anything else earning you gds with a percentage uh, per day. So anyways, guys, I was about to show you guys how I can withdraw my lit earnings here so that I can deposit them into the, well, actually the, I was gonna, sh I was gonna claim my rewards from the ecosystem here with you guys. However, I did the uh, compounding this morning because I forgot to do it yesterday night. So now I can only claim in about seven hours. It's going to be close to 7 a.m. So I won't be able to do it with you guys, but I'm going to try to do it in the next video. Guys, if you have any questions, make sure to come to the late night lit talk this Friday at 8 p.m. EST is going to be fun. It's going to be just before uh, the sauce chat on the uh, hydration show on Friday on DeFi Proofs channel and before Ray's Barter Town conglomerate Dejan Cypher uh, around midnight 